So, hello and welcome to my apartment. Uh, today I'm going to give you a little tour of the apartment so you can see where I've been living for the past year. I'm currently being blinded by the sun because mm, all the windows are to the south. <coughs> and that's part of me being in the sun. God. Let's do that again. So welcome to my apartment. I've been living here for over a year and I'm actually about to move out. So I thought I would do a quick apartment tour both for myself and for the people around me that have been asking to see my place and have never gotten to that the bubble. Have never gotten the chance. So let's go. So this is what you see when you walk into my apartment. Uh, it's a bunch of photos and cards that I've received over the years and I put them over here. Um, and we have the dinner table over here. Unfortunately, I'm going to have to sell that because it doesn't fit into the new apartment. Um, and it has a bunch of nice posters underneath, or above. This is my uh, computer corner. My computer used to be right over there, but since I am moving, I have already taken uh, the computer apart and with me. And then over here we have the bookcase. Uh, it is a little bit of a mess in this corner. Let us skip over the hallway because that's also a mess. And then over here we have the kitchen. Um, small, but it works. Uh, just did the dishes as you can see, so I can leave it in a good state for the person who's temporarily going to be living here before I um, fully move out. A friend of mine is going to watch this place for a few weeks uh, so while he looks for a place in La Huerta and while I um, arrange for my bigger furniture to get moved out. This is the living room. It's very nice. It actually has a glass uh, wall between the living room and the bedroom, but let's first have a look at the living room. This is a little, yeah, I don't even know what it's called. A thing with glass shelves. It has little decorational pieces on it. Uh, so as you can see, we have the feathers, some shells. Down here we have a camera and um, a jellyfish that actually glows in the dark. And over here we have me as a baby which is very cute, and some rocks and stuff. And over here, we have my food stash. So anytime I don't have time to go to the grocery store or something, I can get some food from down there. And this is my plant. It used to be not so happy because it was right over there next to the window. And ever since I moved it about two, three months ago, it's actually been doing a lot better. So I'm happy about that. And then over there, we have the couch. The foldy sleepy couch. This is coming to my next apartment uh, for the guest bedroom. And then over there we have yet again an old camera in a little cupboard with some hidden Funkos, as you can see. And then the old camera down there. My video games and at the bottom shelf there would be books but they are now gone. Um, on the windowsill over here we have a bunch of Gondams that my boyfriend built a ton of them with some flat plants and stuff. My typewriter, yet again an old camera, half a ton of those, and some art. Uh, if we move over here, you see the windowsill to the bedroom, because yeah, there's a window between my living room and my bedroom with more Funkos, one with a random hat. Some of these are pretty recent, others I've had for a long time. And then down here, are all the boxes from all the Gundams we've built. And this is like a big stack box that contains things that we still need to uh, add or things that we have left. And then over here is a banshee that we've been working on. It's, uh, don't know exactly which one it is, but it's difficult. It takes a lot of work. And then over here, right next to where we came from, I have this little corner. It is a little cupboard that contains a lot of just household stuff. And over here I have a bunch of cactuses and a tea box, which apparently leaks, so let's ignore that. And up there we have a plant, spider fern with some mirrors and a clock. And over here, some of Jordan Peterson's rules that I just hung up because I didn't know what else to put there, honestly. And then let's move to the bedroom. Uh, over here is my bed. Say hello to my bed. And another window. So that's where my living room is. And that's the door to my balcony. 
And over here I have the first plant I bought when I moved into this place. And as you can see, there is more Gundams. I even forgot to show the other side of this because there is even more Gundams there. Most of these were built by my boyfriend, but some, I think two of them on these, this side were mine. And if we move to this side, you have mine. I built the SD ones, which are small ones. And I very much enjoy these. As you can see, we have a matching baby banshee. And it's pretty nice. I think I already took one or two with me. Um, but yeah, that happens. <laughs> uh, as you can see, I uh, don't have a wardrobe. So I just have been living with a bunch of, yeah, moving boxes as my closet. It works. It's been like this for a year and I, I'm i still happy with the way it is. Uh, over here we have a boyfriend's clothes and two bedside tables, I think. I use those as wardrobes as well. Welcome to being a student and living in a building that's going to be demolished, aka my curtain isn't attached properly. So I use a blanket <laughs> as part of the window coverage. Uh, over here we have a few prints that I have printed at my work. Uh, the images are not mine. I have adjusted them uh, digitally to actually have these colors and I have added some copper paint to them. But the actual images themselves are from various artists I found online. Um, so credit goes to them. Unfortunately, I don't actually have the credit for all of them, but if you do know who made these, please let me know, because I would like to thank them. Um, well, as I said, over there is my bed, laundry ba baskets, and over there is the door to the bathroom. It actually has another door on the other side of the bathroom, so you could walk in a straight line to the front door, but I am not going to show you my bathroom. I think that's a little odd. Plus, because the building is so old, the bathroom has various issues, which I'd rather not touch on. Um, so there you go. That is my apartment the way it is right now. There's a lot to see, and in a few weeks, most of this is gonna be in the new place. So, I hope you enjoyed. Over there is you. Hi. And me. I hope you liked this little tour, and I will see you in the next video. Bye.